Daniel, how did you uh, get involved with POD? John Rubley from Atlantic Records contacted me. Um, he had seen my work in LA and I think what he saw was the, the emotion and the greediness in my work was somehow going to merge well with the emotion, power, and feeling that POD was creating. So um, I flew out to LA, hooked up with the guys, and, and uh, really felt really at home. Actually felt like I was with family, so it was a really good situation. How did the uh, band decide what image to use for the cover of their album? Sonny had this image of a winged figure that his mother owned, and he had, it was had a lot of meaning to him because it reminded him of his mother. So um, he sent me, he sent it to me. I checked it out. I came up with the drawing based on on that image. What's interesting about the butterfly is throughout history it's had quite a few meanings. It's represented the resurrection and it's also represents the rebirth so it, it's kind of cool that, that um, they went with the butterfly and it, it just has a bunch of meanings and, and I really like the idea of, of it meaning a rebirth. You've been drawing symbols for each of the band members. How did that evolve? They asked me if I would be interested in creating a symbol for each band member and I really felt really comfortable with that because um, symbols are play a really big role in my artwork. I would create, you know, some ideas and, and dig deep and they would go and dig deep in themselves and until finally we ended up with symbols that that um they really felt a, a deep connection to. Tell me about the cards that you're working on. How do they fit into the picture? They symbolize love, faith and death. The idea that I got for them was to create these cards that look like they've been around for hundreds of years. So when I sat down to create them, I, I put tea stains and um, weathered them, just distressed them, and just to create a real old, ancient kind of aesthetic. So when people open the CD and, and they get that card, it's like they're getting something from the past. For some reason, that's kind of the, the trip that I'm on with my art. I, I have this connection to, to the past, and I feel that everything I, that I do artistically, I try to really capture the spirit and the mysticism of the past. So it, it's a deep, deep connection with me. One thing that I'm really, really trying to do for POD is to create something that 10, 20 years from now they're going to be happy with. So I want to try to create something classic that's going to withstand the test of time. POD's music has so much depth and power and, and struggle and life in it. and. Um, and those are the kind of things that I always look for in my artwork. So I think it was a really great connection that that um, we're working together because it seems like we're we're seeking the same thing. The guys wanted something beautiful for the cover, so I used my wife Paula as a model.